What up though? Jay Roos once again. Uh, hope everybody's having a great day. And uh, I know on the intro to this uh, channel I was talking about it would be about part of it would be about everyday observations. Well uh, observation number one. What in the world's happened to television? I mean it's gotten so bad that if it wasn't for YouTube I mean, I probably wouldn't watch anything. I mean, everything's a zombie show or a cop show. And I mean, and what's bad about it, the cop shows, all they do is change locations, like almost like the reality shows. They give you a show in LA and Miami, and they think the audience is so dumbed down, they won't notice that they're not changing the content, they're just changing the city. I mean, if I fed you Frosted Flakes in San Diego and then gave it to you in Cincinnati, I think you notice you're still eating frosted flakes. But uh, that's what they think about society. They think you're so dumbed down you won't even notice. Like, oh, uh, I didn't notice that was the same story I saw last week. I mean, that was in LA. This one's in Miami. Different show. No, same content. And um, I mean, and uh, I just think about, and what happened to TV Land? It used to be a family channel. Now it's like Smut Central. I mean, I can't watch it. And I even used to be a fan of some reality shows, but those have tanked so bad. I mean, you have Love and Hip Hop New York, Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. I think it was Jim Jones that said, what's next, Love and Hip Hop Alaska? <laughs> I mean, come on, you guys. Give us some credit and give us better content or stop watching. I mean, and we also, when we have to pin in the camera, we have to put out better content. We can't blame others for how we look if we're putting out stereotypical movies and stuff, you know? We can't blame anybody but ourselves when we do that. And I, we gotta give props to people like Ryan Coogler, who are doing it the right way. I think he's one of the best directors and writers to come out. He gave us Creed, and I'm hoping he puts out Creed 2 shortly, because that was the one, Creed was one of the best movies I've seen. But uh, we just have to, put out better content and uh, I'm just not gonna watch a show because they put it out I refuse to do that it's like I gotta keep a box of batteries on deck because I'm going through the remote so fast changing channels <laughs> I mean uh, wow anyway I gotta give a shout out to young filmmakers that are doing it correctly in uh, Georgia people like Bobby and Renee Peoples uh, Al G. Sela, OHP Films with my boy Matthew, Darnell Still, people that'll be uh, taking over pretty soon and going worldwide, I'm sure. But uh, we have to support them because they're not going to keep giving you the same stuff that we've been seeing. And I know you guys are tired of it. That's why the internet is so big. One of the reasons because television has just gotten so blatantly whacked. It's just like. I'm wondering who's greenlighting this stuff, who's greenlighting these projects, and uh, man, but uh, oh, shout out to my boy Jason in San Diego, shout out to LSR, shout out to LX, and um, let me know what you guys think about television and how it's tanked so bad lately, and uh, <laughs> like I said, I know you guys are tired of it, but let me know what you guys think. Make sure you comment, subscribe, and remember, remember, always be fearless.